From the start, it seemed unlikely that the stoppage at Norbury Wharf would take the four weeks allocated to it by Canal and River Trust. And as the second week began, the two-man team repairing the brickwork under Bridge 38 had already filled the biggest hole with engineering bricks and were placing another single line of bricks under the rest of the coping stones. By Tuesday, they were removing pumps and working on replacing the three large coping stones that had been lifted to allow them to brick up the larger hole underneath. Perhaps this was the first time those stones had moved in 200 years. Within hours, the coping stones were lime mortared back in place and the water was flowing around the fabric dams to fill the space under Bridge 38. And it was just over a week ago that the water was removed. On Wednesday, the repairs were tidied up and the fencing was being removed from the towpath. The dam contractors arrived, complete with dry suit, to remove the fabric from the dams either side of the bridge. And after much heaving and pulling, the fabric was off and the leaves could carry on their northward journey through the bridge, even if boats couldn't yet. Thursday was a waiting day, which gave us time to think. How did a £32,200 piece of work finish two weeks early, and what did it save the Trust? Canal and River Trust says, we were able to get a clearer picture of the missing brickwork in the towpath wash wall and the repairs needed. This was not as extensive as originally envisaged. Friday, not long after dawn, and the piece of Norbury is broken by the arrival of a team of contractors to remove the scaffolding poles. One man in the water and the rest on the bank, this is a slick operation as brackets are undone and the framework dismantled, ready to go on the vans. Even though we've speeded up the sequence, the men worked so quickly that the canal was open again even before Norbury Wharf opened its doors to customers that morning. The route north and south through Norbury is now open. Although those other stoppages further along the canal may slow boaters down a bit. 